You're handed $2,500 with the one mission. Build the ultimate crypto portfolio. No fluff, no gimmicks, just cold hard strategy. Which coins do you choose? What's the play? Today, we're diving in to craft a portfolio that doesn't suck. And here's the deal. We're not just throwing darts at a wall. This is about calculated plays. And yeah, I'll even share every trade on Twitter. So be sure to follow me there. Since a lot of you keep asking me what to invest in, I wanted to build a portfolio together. We ride together, we die together, but remember, I'm not a registered financial advisor and you should laugh hard at this video. Let's go. To follow along, you'll need an account with Maxi because that's what I'll be using for an exchange. The reason for that is some of you don't like KYC and this exchange offers you to use it without KYC. A link can be found in the description, so be sure to sign up using that if you plan to follow along. The second reason why I'm using Maxi is that they, together with Gate.io, usually list projects very quickly in comparison to Binance and Coinbase, for instance. So that makes most of the tokens much more accessible. And then after opening the account with Maxi, be sure to buy yourself a hardware wallet because all the gains that we'll make on the exchange will be put onto a hardware wallet. And the reason for this is because you might have heard of the phrase, not your keys, not your crypto. I don't want you to follow along on this journey and lose your money in the process because you didn't safeguard your crypto. The Tangent Card is the most affordable and securest option for what we're about to do. Now grab yourself one, use my link and then come back to this tutorial. Right, welcome back and you're all set now. Let's select our projects. Right, Rico, what should I invest in, man? Is it still too late? Well... You're not too late, but you're far from early. If you would have been with me from the start, you'd have some nice entries already. But not every narrative has taken off yet, so there is still money to be made. We have $2,500 to spend, and we need to spend it wisely. If you came here for 100x, then you'll be disappointed, because chasing that 100x means you are also open to losing everything. We're not here to lose it all, but we're not here to gain it all either. Let's try and see if we can turn this $2,500 into, let's say, $5,000. Now, because of this, let's look at the safest coin first, which is Bitcoin. Every portfolio should have Bitcoin in it. Now, Bitcoin is the first decentralized cryptocurrency. Nodes in the peer-to-peer -peer Bitcoin network verify transactions through cryptography and record them in a public distributed ledger called a blockchain without central oversight. Consensus between nodes is achieved using a computational intensive process based on proof of work called mining, and that secures the Bitcoin blockchain. It has the first mover advantage and is considered digital gold. With a maximum supply of 21 million, there will be more and more scarcity over the years, not even taking into consideration the lost or confiscated Bitcoins which will never be retrieved anymore. Now the price surges in a couple of weeks from 66k to 98k, so it might feel as if we're late to the party. However, if it does continue upwards, then we definitely don't want to miss out. Classic portfolios have around 30% of Bitcoin. We're going with 10% for now. And we'll gradually build it up over time using the gains we make from altcoins. Now the first $250 is invested, which means that we're left with $2,250. Moving on to altcoins. Now, altcoins refer to any alternative cryptocurrency to Bitcoin. They often share code and functionality and include coins such as Ethereum, Solana, and Dogecoin. Now, the number of altcoins listed in cryptocurrency markets is rapidly multiplying and they can be very volatile. Sometimes people call them mid to low cap coins as well because they usually have a much lower valuation than, let's say, Bitcoin. Altcoins are also divided into narratives. We have RWA, which stands for Real World Assets. We have GameFi, Layer 1, Layer 2, AI, and so on. Now, personally, I bet big on GameFi, RWA, and AI. So let's find ourselves five projects that we can invest our money in. Okay, so first up is AI, the biggest narrative of them all in the sector or category that will melt faces in the future. The first project is Render, with their total supply almost fully into circulation and their FDV close to their market cap, they are ready to explode. AI is the future and so is Render. In the regular stock market, it's Nvidia that's the biggest company in the world, but I expect Render to be the biggest one in the crypto space. Render Network is a decentralized platform that connects individuals and businesses in need of GPU-based rendering services with providers who have access to GPU capacity. This system enables efficient and cost-effective rendering of complex graphics, benefiting industries such as film, gaming, and virtual reality. The previous all-time high was around $13 with a volume of $1.1 billion. Right now, the price is around $8 with a volume of $470 million. Now, I'm investing $400 in this project. 
Now let's look at RWA. If you go to CoinGecko, you can look for categories. You can do so over here. So cryptocurrencies, categories, and then you can find them there. Now Mantra is currently the biggest project there, which makes it the parent project. If that project goes up, then it's most likely the projects beneath it called the children that are going up too. Now, because we have a tight budget to work with, we want to find ourselves two mid to low cap projects that still have the opportunity to grow. We're going to look at projects that have not already pumped a lot, and we're also going to see what their current price is versus their previous all-time high. And of course, what their volume then and now is. The first token is Origin Trail. Now, I made a dedicated video on this project, so if you want to learn all about it, then please check the video up there. Now, I'm a huge fan of this project and already hold some tokens in my private portfolio as well. They have a circulating supply of around 100 million tokens less than their total supply, which means that there won't be a lot of tokens coming into circulation anymore. Their market cap is close to their fully diluted market cap, and that's great too. Now, in short, Origin Trail is an infrastructure project for AI projects and is very well connected with some amazing partnerships, making this a very solid play. We'll invest $250 here. The second token is going to be a lower cap token. For the simple reason, they still have the potential for massive growth. We already have an infrastructure play within the RWA narrative, so it's now time to look at a lower cap token. Lumia is a rebrand of the Orion protocol. You can buy their tokens, but you can also own one of their nodes, and this will help keep the network decentralized and secure. Since those nodes sold for over $1,000 a while ago, we're not going to bother with them right now. However, I'm interested in their tokens for this portfolio. Lumia is a sophisticated layer 2 blockchain platform aiming to change the decentralized finance landscape with its advanced technology stack and innovative features. Lumia is designed to enhance capital efficiency, liquidity and interoperability within the DeFi ecosystem. Now I made a dedicated video on them a while ago, so be sure to check it out. I'll put it in the description just like all of the other sources used in this video so you can investigate all of this yourself. Now we're going to invest $250 into this project because the risk is a bit higher. And before we go to the rest of this video, I need you to keep in mind that I'm not a registered financial advisor. My videos are meant to be educational and entertaining only. Always do your own research and only invest money you're willing to lose. Because even though you can gain a lot in crypto, you will most likely lose it all. Now, if you do gain a lot, be sure to get a hot wallet like Tangent, which I'll link down below for you for a nice discount as well. Now, let's also take a quick moment to promote my cryptocurrency course to you. Welcome to Crypto with Rico presents the ultimate crypto course, a course designed to take you from crypto curious to crypto confident. Whether you're just beginning to dip your toes into the world of Bitcoin or looking to dive deep into decentralized finance, NFTs and the metaverse, you've come to the right place. Here, you'll get the knowledge you need to understand how cryptocurrency works, how to secure your assets, and most importantly, how to build a solid portfolio that positions you for long-term success in this rapidly evolving space. Get the course now while you still can by clicking the link in the description and let's get cracking. So we've invested $1,000 already, which leaves us with another $1,250 to invest. We already invested into the RWA narrative, so now it's time to invest in the GameFi narrative. The parent coin is Immutable X, so when that moves, everybody else will move as well. Most likely, that is. We're not going to invest into Immutable X, but we are going to invest in Ronin. Now, Ronin hasn't pumped much over the last month, and with all the price action elsewhere, this is a pretty good thing. They do, however, have a very low circulating supply in comparison to their total supply. The previous all-time high was around $4.3 with a volume of $60 million, and right now they have a volume of around $100 million, and they are valued $1.70. Now this has to do with the fact that there are still so many tokens that need to be given out. Now because there are many tokens vested, we want to know what the vesting schedule is. For that we go to Crypto Rank and look at the token Unlock. That's where we see that the next unlock will be 9% of the market cap, which will be on January 27th. So this will mean the price will probably be very volatile around that date. So let's mark that date in our calendars and be sure to exit the token beforehand. We might go back in afterwards, but it all depends on what happens. Be sure to follow my Twitter so you'll get notified immediately when I sell something. Now we're going to put another $250 into Ronin. Next up is Heroes of Mavia. Now, Heroes of Mavia is a blockchain-based multiplayer online strategy game developed by Scry's Studios. Set on the fantasy-themed island of Mavia, players build and defend bases, engage in battles, and earn in-game resources such as gold, oil, and ruby. Now, the game integrates blockchain technology to offer a play-to-earn experience, allowing players to own, upgrade, and trade digital assets represented as NFTs. 
they're also being supported by some of the biggest influencers like Alex Becker and Elio Trace. I've reason to believe they will do very well when GameFi takes off, and that's why we're going to invest $250 here. Now there are two things I haven't spoken about, which are meme tokens and stablecoins. You can actually make money using stablecoins as well. And the best way to do that without impermanent loss is to use liquidity pools, where you can stake your USDT and USDC pairs. Now for that, we're going to use Levium or Elixium in that case. Now and to prevent to drag this video out, I want you all to check the video up there. That will tell you exactly how to bridge your assets to that platform and how you can enter those pools. We're going to place $500 divided into 250 USDT and 250 USDC in those high APR pools. They will pay us out in Elixium tokens, which is a DAX on Elevium. We will sell those tokens daily and swap the Elixium that we get for stablecoins. Those stablecoins will be saved up to use during a dip. Now we also didn't discuss meme tokens and even though I think that won't be the future, there is still a lot of money to be made in them. And that's why we're going to put $100 into meme tokens as well. And in this case, one token which will be dog with hat. The attention went to Peanut, which caused a decline in Whiff. Both of them are active on the Solana chain, and as soon as the hype dies down, we will see money flowing back again. Or at least that's what I think, so that's why I think this would be a good idea to put $100 in that. If we add everything up, we invested 100 in meme tokens, 500 in a stablecoin liquidity pool, 400 in render, 250 in Heroes of Maven, 250 in Ronin, 250 in Lumia, 250 in Origin Trail, and 250 in Bitcoin. Bring our total at $2,250, which means that we have $250 left. We're going to leave that $250 to play around with. It can be invested in memes, it can be invested in other tokens, or it can be kept in stablecoins. Because it's always good to have a bag of stable sideline because you never know when an opportunity will arise. For instance, if the market will drop tremendously, then this means we'll have the liquidity to benefit from this drop. That is, for instance, to lower our entry prices with the tokens that we've already purchased. Now be sure to follow my Twitter so you'll get updated as soon as there are changes. Also be sure to do your own research because I'm not a registered financial advisor. You shouldn't follow my lead nor listen to what I have to say. That said, you can track my portfolio in real time using the link in the description down below. And that's it for now. So be sure to subscribe to my channel because I will be creating follow-up videos on this. And I'll see you guys next time. Doei!